Can someone track my location on Google Maps if I turn off my location settings? Hello, and welcome to today's video. Today, we're going to discuss a common concern among digital device users, privacy. One of the frequently asked questions in this domain is, can Google Maps track my location even if I've turned off my location settings? Let's dive in and answer that. How does Google Maps track locations? First off, it's crucial to understand how Google Maps locates users. Google Maps uses GPS, Wi-Fi, mobile networks, and sensors to pinpoint your location. This data, combined with Google's extensive mapping information, allows the app to provide services like turn-by-turn -turn directions and local business recommendations. What happens when I turn off my location settings? When you turn off your location settings, Google Maps can no longer directly access your GPS or other location services. This means that it can't track your precise location. However, it's important to note that Google may still infer some location data based on other activities. For example, if you're logged into your Google account and use Google search to look for restaurants in a certain area, Google may infer your general location based on that. Or, if you're connected to a Wi-Fi network, Google might have a rough idea of where you are based on the network's location. Is there a way to completely stop Google from tracking me? If you want to prevent Google from inferring your location even indirectly, you'll need to take a few extra steps. 1. First, you can use Google's privacy settings to limit what information Google collects about your activities. 2. Second, consider using a VPN to hide your IP address and location. 3. And third, regularly delete your activity history in your Google account. To wrap it up, Turning off your location settings does prevent Google Maps from directly tracking your location, but it might not completely prevent Google from inferring your general location based on your activities. If you want more privacy, consider adjusting your Google privacy settings, using a VPN, and deleting your activity history regularly. Remember, you have control over your digital privacy. Hope you found this video helpful. Stay safe and see you in the next one.